all right hey guys welcome back to my channel today i'm back with another video today's video is going to be another skin combo video and yes i know i told you guys that i am kind of tired of making skin combo videos but you know what uh this cool new skin came out today the derby dynamo skin and it looks pretty nice so i decided to go ahead and make a skin combo for each one of the styles so if you guys are interested in that go and hit that like button subscribe with notifications on and yeah let's go ahead and get started all right so for the very first one i chose the first style obviously and for the first style she has colors uh, or three different colors, which are black, white, and pink. As you guys can see, her glasses are pink, her hair is pink, and then her helmet and chest, chest piece and everything else on her skin is basically black and white. So that is why all, everything that I have in this skin combo basically match with both of the colors on her skin. So the first one for the back bling, I chose the Stark Satchel. This was introduced in Season 9, and it was a part of the Shadow Skin Pack. Uh, it looks pretty nice, and it does match the black and white on her skin. As I said, her skin does have some pink on it as well. So I decided to go and go with this pickaxe, Star Shot. It was introducing Chapter 2 Season 1 with Hay skin. So if you guys have this pickaxe, you can go and use it because her skin does obviously have some pink and basically some red parts on it as well. For the glider, I chose the Webrella. This was introduced in Season 6. You guys were able to unlock this play winning game match in Season 6. Contra, I chose Glitch in the System. This was introduced in Season 5. I was a part of the Battle Pass. And then lastly for the wrap, I, I decided to go ahead and choose a wrap that could match with all three of the the colors on her skin i could not find a wrap that had pink black and white on it at the same time but i found this which is pretty close it has red black and silver color on it which is pretty cool so i decided to go and go ahead and use this one now if this is the first time you guys are watching my skin combo videos i usually go and show you guys the skin combo that i created for this skin and then i go and show you guys a gameplay of how it looks like in game so you guys could actually decide on which skin combo is the best one for you so let's go and get some gameplay Now, while you guys are watching the gameplay, I just want to go and clear some stuff for my avid viewers. If you guys have not watched my channel update video, you can go and check it out on top right of your screen. Just click on that card after you watch this video uh, because it will help you guys understand some things if you guys have not watched that video. First thing, I did say in that video that I'm kind of tired of making skin combos and I can quote myself saying I hate skin combo videos. But I did say after that that uh, maybe I took, maybe I was too harsh for skin combos because those were one of the only videos that actually made my channel grow. And uh, I said I was going to keep it for now because those are some of the videos that actually give me some views and some subscribers and traffic to this channel. Unless YouTube decides to recommend my videos. But for now, since YouTube does not want to go ahead and do that, I will have to do some stuff to go ahead and get some you know get my channel out there and get some viewership and more traffic to my channel so uh all i'm saying is i'm gonna be honest with you guys i'm basically doing these videos for the views for the you know likes and watch time because obviously who doesn't want to do that i hope you guys understand and if you guys are new to the channel you probably don't have an you probably do not have any idea what's going on all i'm saying is just watch my update video you guys will understand Now that everything is cleared up with you guys, I will go and show you guys the second skin combo that I made for this style. Alright, so for the back link, I chose the Shattered Wing. This was introduced in Season 8. It was a part of the Dream skin set. You guys were able to actually unlock this by purchasing Dream. For the Glider, or for the Harvesting tool, I chose Sparkle Scythe. This was introduced in Season X. Part of the Battle Pass. For the Glider, I chose Holographic. This was introduced in Season 9. You guys were able to unlock this by winning a match in Season 9. And then lastly, for the Contrail, I chose Rainbow. This was introduced in Season 3. It was a part of the Battle Pass. And then for the Rap, I chose Enigma. This was introduced in Season 9. It was... And you guys were able to purchase it for 500 V-Bucks in Season 9.
And then finally, guys, we have arrived at the last skin combo. For the third skin combo, for the back wing, I chose Ridgeback. This is for the third style, which is the red and black style. And honestly, this back wing fits her so perfectly because she does have that devil tail. And uh, these uh, wings look pretty nice. Look pretty demonic, I guess. And it was introduced with Haze. Also, was introduced in Chapter 2 Season 1. For the Harvesting Tool, I chose Thorn. This was introduced in Chapter 2 Season 2 with the Rue skin set. And I chose the first style, the red and black style. For the glider, I chose Paper para Parasol. For the glider, I chose Paper Parasol. It was introduced in Season 3. You guys were able to unlock this by winning a game match in Season 3. For the Contrail, I chose Bats. This was introduced in Season 6. It was part of the Battle Pass. And then lastly, for the wrap, I chose Knighted. This was introduced in Season X. It was a part of the Battle Pass as well. Alright, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did, go and hit that like button, subscribe with notifications on. And yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.